and it has been back to back and I had my show as well and I mean I just thank God for strength for health and I'm just hoping I'll be able to get more energy to okay so we just witnessed Darko and Black Shari performing their favorite hit song and I'm sure many of you dance so Darko this is your first time in Ghana or not? No, no, no. This is my this is my twentieth time in Ghana. But this is your first time being on the stage right now. No. Black Shabbos. Third. Third time. Yeah. What's the difference between the other stages you've been on and this one? You know, everyone came out for Black Hole. The love is just for him. I like that. You know, when everyone's like the same fan base out here, showing love to each other. Talk to me, bro. You just finished a performance. I know you do this in your sleep. I mean, you wake up and you just you just come and we outside, we outside. outside we funny outside. enough, you're actually outside because you're born team. Talk yeah. to me about the stage. Talk to me about what you've seen so far. And yeah, anything else you want to say to your fans? Um, listen, they just want to say congrats. A big, big congrats to Blackwood. This is phenomenal. This is magical. This is crazy, Charlie. And I'm honored to be here to I share like with that, you. Know, when everyone's God bless like, him. Let's keep supporting this music. Let's keep streaming gang music. Talk to just me. What it is, bro, Finish a performance. I know you do this in your sleep. You wake up and you just come and are you a black or fan? Are you here to fall in love with him? Are you came here by invitation? No, I'm already in love with him. I'm a black or fan. Like I'm just a black or fan. That's why I'm here. What, what are your favorite songs of the album? I love his music and seeing him today like it's really going to excite me the most. Yeah, so I'm happy to see him today. Talk to me about what you've seen so far. What are your expectations and uh, what are you looking forward to see Black Co perform? Oh, I've seen a lot. Yeah, it's exciting. People are coming on stage. But I came here for the big one, the big man. And he's not yet in, so we are waiting for him. I'm here till he drops. I want to say congrats. A big, big congrats to Black Co. This is phenomenal. This is magical. This is crazy. And I'm honored to be here to see you. I like that, you know, when everyone's like, the same fan base I am. Wow, 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 what a night, what a show. I'm sitting next to the man of the moment. Uh, I don't even know what to say, so I'm just gonna let him do the talking. Blacko, first time ever. Wow in the crowd, wow in the audience, back to back hits. Black, you know, I just realized that your catalog is actually big. It's what large. Is that about that, <laughs> the catalog is crazy. Yeah. From features to originals to some of the interesting songs that you drop. Talk to me about the set list, talking about everything, the performance, before we get into the nitty gritty. See, first of all, my performance, my everything, my energy. In original, in basis, be the fans. Because they, in them, we take them, build the cup. You understand me? Their energy, everything, how did they accept me? Like how they do everything, you understand me? So, first of all, big thanks to the fans. Plus, next, the message. So, I want me to hear them. That be how I want me to feel when they listen to me. How they put them in my shoes. That be how they do this kind of performances, you understand me? After everything, if they go house, it goes stuck for them in my head. You understand me? That's it. So back to back hits from the man Blacko giving us all that he can right on the stage. Mozama Disco Concert, the Genesis right here at La Palm Royal Beach Gardens. And I'm sure you guys had fun as much as we did. I have lost my voice. But to then, we're back in another episode of We Outside. The name is Olale Salvador. See you next week.
Good evening Ghana, good evening Africa, good evening world. What time it is? It's about 10 o'clock and we are back again with yet an exciting episode of We Outside. My name is Olale Salvador, your regular host and guess where we are? You can look behind me, it's all beautiful scenes going on right here because we are here to witness the first ever concert by the man Black Sharif aka Kweku Frimpong aka Kweku the Traveler. Most of our discnesses, grab a drink because we are bringing you all the sights and sounds right here. Catch ya. I tell myself this words every time on the road And I'm still grinding cause you still die where I'm from We could have black sheep, no they give up no way I run from mouse to chase the koala, my jaga Plenty cause they free me fear so my father they vex me tired for my house, but I know me. Okay, so the Queen of Ghana music just finished her performance on stage. As you always know it, rocking it like no one's business. And I get an opportunity to get to talk to her. Wendy, how are you feeling right about now? I know I know it, this is not really your stage, but you come, you do your thing, and you come and chill out. Talk to me about the process. Talk to me about going on stage and performing such a crowd. Um, I don't know. I think I just cook, cause and know that when I go on stage I'm going to kill it you know I have to feed my fans something right. so you know those are the thoughts I meditate on right. before I get on stage you know what I'm struggling to believe right now like I just saw you on stage and you were being radical and you know doing what you do best and all of a sudden you're just calm and sweet and nice like you can't even kill a fly ready what's going on I don't know I think it's just my nature is this your nature yeah it's in me I think I <laughs> so now, talk to me about what you just did tonight how is it different from any other stage you've been on um, let me see. The feeling never gets old. I'm always nervous. I don't think it, it can ever change. Apparently, it's like that forever. Oh, yeah, yeah. Always nervous before. Jackie, I just saw you at Money Festivities. We talked a bit about, you know, how incredible he has been for you. But I'm more interested in your energy levels. How are you managing your health, your stress, all these things? Because you just came here, you did, and I'm sure you have a couple of shows coming up next. Yeah, yeah. Um, I would say thanks to God because it's not easy. I've, I've, I think I've had shows since... 8th December and it has been back to back and I had my show as well and I mean I just thank God for strength for health and I'm just hoping I'll be able to get more energy today. Okay so we just witnessed Darko and Black Shari performing their favorite hit song and I'm sure many of you dance with Darko this is your first time in Ghana or not? No, no, no. This is my, this is my 20th time in Ghana. But this is your first time being on the stage right now. No. Black Shari. Third. Third time? Yeah. What's the difference between the other stages you've been on and this one? You know, everyone came out for Black Hole. The love is just for him. I like that, you know, when everyone's like the same fan base out here, showing love to each other. I appreciate that. I like that. Talk to me. Bro, you just finished your performance. I know you do this in your sleep. I mean, you wake up and you just, you just come and we outside, we outside. Yeah, we if outside. funny enough, you're actually outside because you're born team. Talk yeah. to me about the stage. Talk to me about what you've seen so far. And yeah, anything else you want to say to your fans? Um, listen, there's just one word I just want to say. Congrats. A big, big congrats to Blacko. This is phenomenal. This is magical. This is crazy, Charlie. And I'm honored to be here to share with him. God bless him. Let's keep supporting his music. Let's keep streaming Ghana music. That's just what it is, Charlie. Are you a Blacko fan? Are you here to fall in love with him? Or you came here by invitation? No, I'm already in love with him. I'm a Blacko fan, like 100% Blacko fan. That's why I'm here. What, what are your favorite songs of the album? Sad Boys Don't Fall, 45, Killer, Soldier, Ninina, all of them. He's had an amazing year, and that's like Blacko season challenge. I love his music, and seeing him today, like, it's really going to excite me the most. Yeah, so I'm happy to see him today. Talk to me about what you've seen so far. What are your expectations and uh, what are you looking forward to see Blacko perform? Oh, I've seen a lot. Yeah, it's exciting. People are coming on stage. But I came here for the big one, the big man. And he's not yet in, so we are waiting for him. I'm here till he drops.
Wow, 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 what a night, what a show. I'm sitting next to the man of the moment. Uh, I don't even know what to say, so I'm just gonna let him do the talking. Blocko, first time ever. Wow in the crowd, wow in the audience, back to back hits. Blocko, you know, I just realized that your catalog is actually big, it's large. <laughs> the catalog is crazy. Yeah. From features to originals to some of the interesting songs that you drop. Talk to me about the set list, talking about everything in the performance before we get into the nitty gritty. See, first of all, my performance, my everything, my energy. In original, in basis, be the fans. Cause they, in them, we take them, build the cup. You understand me? Their energy, everything. How did they accept me? It is shape how they write, how they do everything. You understand me? So first of all, big thanks to the fans. Plus, next the message. So I want me to hear them. That be how I want me to feel when they listen to me. I they put them in my shoes. That be how they do this kind of performances. You understand me? After everything, if they go house, it goes stuck for them ahead. You understand me? That's it. So back to back hits from the man Blacko, giving us all that he can right on the stage. Mozama Disco Concert, the Genesis right here at La Palm Royal Beach Gardens. And I'm sure you guys had fun as much as we did. I have lost my voice. But until then, we're back again with another episode of We Outside. The name is Olale Salvador. See you next week. <laughs> Why so serious? No, 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 no. Good evening Ghana, good evening Africa, good evening world. What time it is? It's about 10 o'clock and we are back again with yet an exciting episode of We Outside. My name is Olale Salvador, your regular host and guess where we are? You can look behind me, it's all beautiful scenes going on right here because we are here to witness the first ever concert by the man Black Sharif aka Kweku Frimpong aka Kweku the Traveler. Muslim Disco Concert, The Genesis, grab a drink because we are bringing you all the sights and sounds right here. Catch I tell myself this words every time on the road And I'm still grinding cause it's too that where I'm from But could that black sheep know they give up no way I run from us to chase the koala my jaga Plenty calls they free me fear so my father they vex me tired for my house, but I know. Okay, so the Queen of Ghana music just finished her performance on stage. As you always know it, rocking it like no one's business. And I get an opportunity to get to talk to her. Wendy, how are you feeling right about now? I know I know it, this is not really your stage, but you come, you do your thing and you come and chill out. Talk to me about the process. Talk to me about going on stage and performing such a crowd. Um, I don't know. I think I just focus and know that when I go on stage I'm going to kill it you know I have to feed my fans something right. so you know those are the thoughts I meditate on before I get on stage you know what I'm struggling to believe right now like I just saw you on stage and you were being radical and you know doing what you do best and all of a sudden you're just calm and sweet and nice like you can't even kill a fly ready what's going on <laughs> I don't know I think it's just my nature is this your nature huh? yeah it's in me I think I have two sides or something <laughs> so now talk to me about what you just did tonight how is it different from any other stage you've been on um, let me see. The feeling never gets old. I'm always nervous. I don't think it, it can ever change. Apparently, it's like that forever. Oh, yeah, yeah. Always nervous before the performance, but after, then I'm calm. So I'm calm right now. But it was, it was, it was good energy. It was great, yeah. I am here with the Asa Cowboys. Ladies and gentlemen, Comerica is in the building. And as you can see, it's, it's, it's a battalion. Jay, Charlie, now for, for some of us, this is the first time we are going to see some of you perform. For those of them in the stores right now, 
what is what is what what is the expectation you want them to come with? What what is it that we want people to see from you guys? Energy, you know, when we talk about drill, drill is about energy. So did you expect the same energy? I'm seeing you right now, you're very calm and collected, yeah. but only God knows what you're going to do on stage. I expect the unexpected, man. Man. I expect the unexpected man. Right. I mean, we're coming through with the fire, man. More energy. Right. You know how we do. So, right. Yeah, running the car say. Now my bread dies a waste man. They grow, I'm away. He's a waste man in the wasteland. They watch make it they go. When money holders make the rules and regulations, my take I only that die the guy. Now my bread dies a waste man. They they grow, I'm away. Jackie, I just saw you at Money Festivities. We talked a bit about you know how incredible he has been for you. But I'm more interested in your energy levels. How are you managing your health, your stress, all these things? Because you just came here, you did, and I'm sure you have a couple of shows coming up next. Yeah, yeah. Um, I would say thanks to God because it's not easy. I've, I've, I think I've had shows since. 8th December and it has been back to back and I had my show as well and I mean I just thank God for strength for health and I'm just hoping I'll be able to get more energy today. Okay so we just witnessed Darko and Black Shari performing their favorite hit song and I'm sure many of you dance here. Darko, this is your first time in Ghana or not? No, 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 this is my, this is my 20th time in Ghana. But this is your first time being on the stage right here? No. The Black Shari. Third. Third time? Yeah. What's the difference between the other stages you've been on and this one? You know everyone came up for Black Oh, the love is just for him. I like that, you know, when everyone's like the same fan base out here, showing love to each other. I appreciate that. I like that. Talk to me, bro. You just finished your performance. I know you do this in your sleep. I mean, you wake up and you just, you just come and we outside, we outside. Yeah, outside, outside. outside. If funny outside. enough, you're actually outside because you are born team. Talk yeah. to me about the stage, talk to me about what you've seen so far. And yeah, anything else you want to say to your fans? Um, listen, there's just one word I just want to say. Congrats. A big, big congrats to Blacko. This is phenomenal. This is magical. This is crazy, Charlie. And I'm honored to be here to share with him. God bless him. Let's keep supporting his music. Let's keep streaming Ghana music. That's just what it is, Charlie. Are you a Blacko fan? Are you here to fall in love with him? Or you came here by invitation? No, I'm already in love with him. I'm a Blacko fan, like 100% Blacko fan. That's why I'm here. What, what are your favorite songs of the album? Sad Boys Don't Fall, 45, Killer, Soldier, Ninina, all of them. He's had an amazing year, and that's like Blacko season challenge. I love his music, and seeing him today, like, it's really going to excite me the most. Yeah, so I'm happy to see him today. Talk to me about what you've seen so far. What are your expectations and uh, what are you looking forward to see Blacko perform? Oh, I've seen a lot. Yeah, it's exciting. People are coming on stage. But I came here for the big one, the big man. And he's not yet in, so we are waiting for him. I'm here till he drops. Ghana, good evening Africa, good evening world. What time is it? It's about 10 o'clock and we are back again. We get an exciting episode and I'm very of We Outside. Because the because name is Olele Salvador, your regular host. And guess where we are? You can look behind you know, me at all beautiful scenes going on right here because right we are here in Ghana. to witness the first ever concert by the man Black Sherry, a.k.a. Kweku Fimpo, a.k.a. Kweku the Kabla. Most of our disco concert, the Genesis, grab a drink because we are bringing you all the sights and sounds right here. I tell myself this was every time on the road And I'm still grinding cause it's too that where I'm from
Thank you very much. Please put your hands together. Now we can officially access the store. We can open now and access the store. First person I'm going to be talking to is the MC of the official launch, yes. Jay Foley. Thank you. Jay, do you get any of the things? Unfortunately, I just got some cards, a few call cards, but it's fine. It's still networking, right? <laughs> <laughs> which of which of the products were you eyeing, though? Well, so when I when I when I got here, I saw the um, the Bluetooth uh, uh, headset devices. You know, I, I wish I could get one. I would get one, I think, and I want to replace my AirPods as well. How sure are you you'll get one? Um, no, I'll buy it. I'll buy you one, don't worry. Thank you very much. I'll take your dreams, though. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I have the Danish ambassador here with me and I'm just going to be asking him his thoughts generally on the brand Bank and Olufsen. Hi sir. Hi there, it's very good to be here and very good to talk to you. Very good to have you here. No, it's, it's, it's wonderful to be here and to see a Danish brand, a very, very famous Danish brand, also making it to Ghana, making it to Accra. It's of course a brand that has been around for a hundred years, so it's really old, but I will tell you it's definitely not old fashioned. It's, Definitely. it's super up to speed. Yep. Okay, so I have here with me the CEO of Three Media Networks, Rashida Yasmin Abdullahi. Now she was front and center in organizing this event, the official launch of Bank and Olivsen. It's just a month. We use the month to organize, you know, this whole event. Thankfully enough, it's been a success. Started from, you know, the ideation to the planning to contacting vendors, you know, and putting the whole show together. I'll say it's a teamwork, and um, this I like to use this as an opportunity to let uh, proper bodies out there know that yes, Three Media is the one and only organization or media event you should contact. So yes, um, it's been fun. I think the whole idea was to get this team together as quick and successful and exquisite as it should be and I believe we've achieved that so for me congratulations to all of us yes Brandon Olufsen is coming up with some promotions this December so check them up on their um, social media handles or uh, move to their shop at Atlantic Towers to get something for yourself so I draw one a product from Bank and Olufsen I did mention earlier that you know we, we did a giveaway so this is the Bank and Olufsen Explore durable portable speakers. I'm eyeing that. Trust me, I'm eyeing that. <laughs> What's the feeling? I'm super excited. I mean, I give gifts to my clients and I always give them this beautiful gift. I've been eyeing it for myself. So when I when it got to the last one and nobody had chosen this, I was just praying that my name would be picked and lo and behold, I'm the owner of the new <laughs> It's just, it's just to, to say that it was made for you. So I mean, nobody would have and could have picked, picked that. We're still here at the bank and all of some showroom for the official opening of the showroom. I have to my right Alaji Baba Halidu, chairman and CEO of the Bahamas Group. I just want him to tell us the experience here at the showroom and what people are to expect from this beautiful place in terms of the equipment and the consumer electronics available from Bang and Olufsen. Yes, so thank you so much um, for having me. Um, in fact, the experience is just amazing. Um, I mean, everyone that came in, I mean, the, the magic, you know, all of the, almost all of them felt the magic. And um, I think um, it's just an exciting show, knowing very well at least everyone that, that, that came in had that kind of experience that we wanted them to have. So, I mean, in all, it's been a good show. Excellent, excellent. Myself, very impressed. We saw the man Sarko here at the official unveiling of the Bang & Olufsen showroom.
right, so it's a beautiful evening here at the B&O showroom. We're doing the official unveiling and we caught up with the amazing Jackie of PR. I saw her inside um, earlier on experiencing the B&O audio systems. What do you think about the whole experience today? I think it's magical. The sound is just magical. Um, picture quality is on point. Everything is just excellent.